Well, it started by the British Council asking us to think about a way of connecting uh, young creative people in South Africa with young creative people in the UK. And we thought that uh, with today's digital tools, we could do something that they don't have, which is peer-to-peer -peer learning, like being on the same course. Like here, they are learning from each other as much as they are learning from the, the teachers. And the... So peer-to-peer -peer learning was the kind of idea, but also we uh, were thinking that uh, following this exhibition, The Power of Making, we learned a lot about the idea of sharing knowledge of making. The Maker Library is also about kind of hacking the idea of what libraries do, which they help local people to understand the world, really, through books and through reference. And, um, and so we think making can do that as well and should happen. And so that we thought little studios could become a little library about making and help uh, people learn skills, see new things, and also for themselves to connect their making to other people and understand what they are part of. And so each little maker library promises to teach skills, share their books, and show someone else's work, which means they have to consider their work in relation to others. Uh, we also always say, show the most uh, distance from your work. Don't show something like what you're doing. Try and be as far away to see the largest scope of reference. But what happened is that uh, these uh, maker libraries um, became kind of uh, quite successful for uh, these uh, little studios in terms of making them different from other studios. It gave them a new identity, new way of working, curatorial approach to things, and it became a kind of add-on to their studios, a, a place for debate, cultural, critical thinking. And so other maker spaces in other countries also started looking at this format. And now it's over four or five countries. There are over 15 maker libraries, but also the format itself is happening outside the maker library network that is run by the British Council. Um, and part of, of that is that it's really connecting to what's happening in maker spaces and in maker culture. 